www.udo.de Hey there, my name is Thomas from Voodoo EVR. There's a small little breaking news here. Very interesting for me personally. So to be honest, I was not so interested in the Apple Vision Pro because I'm more a gamer. I want to be in virtual re reality. I want to use my hands and, and controllers and so on. And that's not really possible with the Apple Vision Pro. You cannot play Half-Life Alyx and all that stuff. So it was not so interesting for me. But now, guys, there will be a way to do Steam VR with the Apple Vision Pro soon. Because the developer from Ivory, you know Ivory, they are developing something for the, to connect the PlayStation VR 2 to the PC. They are developing Steam VR drivers for the Apple Vision Pro. Holy moly! It's not so easy than you think. Let's talk about this later. But imagine you can play Half-Life Alyx with the awesome display of the Apple Vision Pro and the Valve Index controllers. This is insane. <laughs> so, but to be honest, I'm, I didn't try the Apple Vision Pro yet. I will somewhere, somewhere soon. I think I will. Um, but uh, the, the problem is that the small field of view that's likely on the, on the Apple Vision Pro. Everybody says it's smaller than the Quest 3, but I have to try it for myself. So, but I want to play like the Steam VR games uh, on this cool display. So, so it will also be possible not only to connect the headset to Steam VR, but also tracked controllers and this is even insane this is so cool but it's not so easy than you think so first you have to buy the ivory driver uh, as i understood it's not for free you have to buy it also in the apple store uh, apple app store and then you <laughs> you will need a second headset as a hub that means for example you can use the controllers of the Quest 3 or Quest 2 together with the Apple Vision Pro. But you need the Quest connected at the same time to your PC because it's sort of a hub. Yeah, so the Quest 3 is the hub for the controllers and the Apple Vision Pro is the headset with the display. <laughs> That's really insane. So you have to connect two headsets to your PC at the same time. The same is with the index controllers. You can also use the index controllers with the Apple Vision Pro, but only when your Valve Index is also connected. So it gets very expensive <laughs> if you don't already have such a headset. I mean, I have them all, so this would not be a problem for me. Um, but there's also another way, at least uh, they write it from uh, uh, Roto VR here. You can also buy the dongle from Tundra Labs and then you don't need a second headset. This is very, very interesting. So if you manage to get one of those dongles from Tundra Labs, this could be very interesting. Um, yeah, what do you think about that? I mean, this is cool. I, I mean, <laughs> it's still very expensive. And to be honest, as I said at the beginning, it was not the, the Vision Pro is not so interesting. That's why I'm I was not flying to the States just for buying that and doing a review and then put it in the shelf because I know it's not enough for me to just have a headset where you can watch movies and some flying um, stuff around there. Uh, it's just not worth for me three thousand five hundred dollars and not even four thousand five hundred euros in Germany or whatever it costs here. But, the, I mean, the software from the Apple Vision Pro is nice. The, the Apple system, everything works good with the um, hand tracking, eye tracking, we know that. But now when we can connect it to Steam VR and play all the Steam VR games with it, with the index controllers, for example, this is gonna be wow. This is gonna be wow. But I want them to do it very good. We don't need something that doesn't work where the controller flying around and where there's some problems or stuttering or so on. They have to do it good, the guys from Ivory. And then 
the Apple Vision Pro gets much more interesting for me, to be honest. Yeah? Very interesting. I mean, I have all the stuff here that I need. I have the Quest, I have the Index, I have all the Tundra Lab stuff. So this is not a problem for me, but I need the Apple Vision Pro. <laughs> and the drivers are not out yet. They will take some time to bring it out in a way so that it works good. So be patient if you have the Apple Vision Pro. And yeah, this is, this is uh, really cool news. What do you think? Is the Apple Vision Pro now more interesting for you? Uh, when you think about that it will work with the Ivory drivers? Or do you still say, no, uh, leave me alone with that shit, it's too expensive and so on. Write it in the comments below. Uh, if you want to read this article of Roto VR, I will put it in the description below. So, guys, thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe and see you next time in virtual reality. See ya! Voodoo